Welcome back. We're just about to start some meal prep, but that's not the point of this video. It's a little too soon in our relationship to talk about food, but we will get there. Um, so I wanted to talk about why you should even watch this at all, or tell you the details of my life and why this preparation might be of any interest at all to watch to anybody. Um, so. I'm 38 years old. I work at a home improvement store, a good one, the best one. And I, I do well at my job, like, I make enough money to live. Like, I'm unfortunately broke because of bad decisions I've made in life. Um, which brings me to the next point. I've, being 38 years old, I've had plenty of time to make some mistakes. And probably the greatest mistake in my life is being an alcoholic. <laughs> uh, not sure I had much control over that, but um, I was a practicing alcoholic uh, from, for about 22 years uh, and made plenty of bad decisions uh, under the influence. Um, got arrested several times, I uh, mentioned in the previous video, we got four DUIs. Um, this, I'm 38 years old. I've got a record, including a felony. I'm one fuck up from going to prison. I have been to jail. Uh, I spent three months in jail over this past year, 2020. So that's how 2020 went for me, it was pretty cool. Um, and, you know, don't really have any money in the bank. Don't have a girlfriend, single. Uh, which is probably for the best. And, you know what, things were, you know, adding up so swimmingly, you know, all this that I'm telling you about. I even decided to get a mohawk. Because um, it's like, what else could, what could possibly make this situation any worse? It's like, fuck it, right? Um, So that's the situation my life is in. Uh, so I, I got out of jail two months ago. Um, and that was, honestly, jail was a great learning experience. Um, I just saw some stuff there that I just not believe. Um, if you're ever feeling bad about yourself, go to jail, you can see some people in some bad freaking situations. So, Just remember, if you're ever feeling bad about your life, at least you're not a child molester. <laughs> um, so, while I was in jail, um, that's when I got the idea to do the PCT. Uh, that would be my, my goal. Uh, because you know, one of the other big topics we're gonna talk about in this series um, is recovery, because I'm a recovering alcoholic. Um, and I decided in jail to set this short-term goal of hiking the PCT because once you get sober, I mean, that's a great accomplishment in itself, but then it's like, now what? And setting a, like, five-year goal, a ten-year goal, that is, like, that is a recipe for failure because I'm the legs are impatient. I know I am. Uh, and it's like, I want to see some results immediately. Because like, you stop drinking and life gets super freaking boring. Um, you're not causing any more problems for yourself, you're not adding to your amends list, things like that. <clears throat> you're just like, you're being a good boy, you're going home, going to work, you're sleeping in your own bed, and you're not causing trouble. Uh, and that's great. That's what you, that's the basis you want for your life, that's where I'm at right now. Is that I'm not causing more trouble for myself, but now, I need a goal. Um, <clears throat> and for the reasons I just listed just a little bit ago is I have a pretty forgiving job. 
Like, I work in a freaking hardware store, it's like, it's not like, I'm going to be giving up any careers. Uh, and plus they're pretty forgiving time off, so I'm pretty sure they're not going to give me trouble with it. Um, I don't have a girlfriend, not married, I don't have any kids, um, I don't own a house, I rent, uh, I'm in my beautiful rented kitchen right now, uh, don't have any pets, uh, I don't have a driver's license, <laughs> uh, it, there's plenty of shit that I don't have, uh, which allows me to make time for this hike. Um, and besides that, in 2022, when I plan on doing this hike, I turned 40 years old. So that is, those are the main reasons why I'm doing this hike. Why I'm choosing to do it now. Because I don't have much left to lose. I don't have anything holding me back. Really have no responsibility. Um, and I need a short-term goal to focus on if I want to, I mean, I'm going to stay sober, but it's going to help me stay sober, having something to focus on. And so, you stop to interest you, you think you're in a similar position, maybe you're in recovery and you want to do Something cool with your life. Maybe maybe you think you fucked up too much. Like you like your life is screwed up and that you you're not gonna be able to do something like this. And, and the point of this video is gonna be to tell you that you can do this. If I can do this, you can do it. I got a lot of shit to deal with making that trail. And so, when I successfully hike away from the Mexican border, I'll prove to y'all that you can do this too. No matter what your current situation, you got this. So, in future segments, we're gonna cover fitness, we're gonna cover nutrition, we're gonna cover mindset. It's gonna be big. We're gonna cover your daily life. We're gonna cover how to deal with work. Cause I know that's gonna be scary. I don't, I don't feel good about it. I can't wait to tell my manager like, hey, I'm gonna leave for six months. Um, so you just got out of jail, right? <laughs> I know, right? Um, so we're gonna cover that. We're gonna cover where to get your gear so that you don't break your bank. We're gonna cover what your work. I've got a whole summer of trips where I get to test gear. That's the beauty of scheduling this a year out. And so, you're gonna learn a lot over this next year with me, so please, stay tuned. Um, whether you're into recovery, whether you're into backpacking, whether you're into ultra, light, marathon style hiking, like whatever you're into, we're gonna have a little bit of something for everybody. And if you're not into any of that, I have a really weird life. Maybe you're just into that. I don't care. Thank you for hanging out. I'm going to let you know how this pork roast turns out in about 30, 40 minutes. And maybe a little bit later this evening, we will cover some training, uh, some physical training um, considerations. All right.